We drove from Atlanta through Tennessee, Kentucky, and Illinois to finally reach St. Louis, Missouri. We spent some time to explore the St. Louis Old Courthouse and the Gateway Arch National Park, including riding up the famous St. Louis Arch Elevator all the way to the top of the arch. We continued on with our journey to Hannibal, Missouri, where we visited the Mark Twain Boyhood Home and Museum, and finally driving across into the great state of Iowa. America's farmland. America's breadbasket. Breadbasket. What you doing, Michael? I'm getting dressed up as the the old man from American Gothic. No, no, oh. come back around here. Okay. No. Oh. It's funny because they said, do not cover your face of your partners. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm the daughter. <laughs> You're good to go. Oh, simple enough. Mm-hmm. Kelsey, okay. Bless you, Right here. So we are in Eldon, Iowa, and I'm a farmer's daughter, I guess. And it's an iconic building right behind me, as you're probably familiar with. All right, get it on camera mode, would you? Yes. <laughs> would you get back in the sand? <laughs> He's about to stab me here pretty soon. <laughs> ow, ow. If you do want to pose, you could actually stand right here on the window frame and then someone will have to know how to where to take a picture. And our journey continues and we finally reach our final destination of Ames, Iowa, the home of the Iowa State Cyclones. Wait, why are we here in the great state of Iowa? because I went to school here at Iowa State University. And this year, our fraternity is hosting a 100th year anniversary establishment at Iowa State University. And I was invited to become one of the speakers at the Great Banquet. The next day, we continued on with our journey through Iowa and we're ready to go. I, re I remember the name. I don't remember the name. We are currently in Riverside, Iowa. I had a little surprise for Michael. This is supposed to be a place that important for Michael and we're gonna show you something that would be interested for Star Trek fans. So they have a few signs like this all around town. Look at Michael's kicking out. I'm more of a next generation type of person so this is cool. Where's Chewbacca? I just keep giggling because it's funny. Look, they have the USS Enterprise. Since Holoff has no idea what he's talking about, this is the future birthplace of Captain James T. Kirk as depicted in Star Trek The Voyage Home. There, you learned something today. Right. Did he really, will he really born here? Whatever. This is, this is right, this is, this is the address where Captain James T. Kirk will be born in the year 2228. We stopped by the Herbert Hoover National Historic Site in West Branch, Iowa. He was the 31st President of the United States of America.
Our next stop in the journey was the Iowa 80, claimed to be the world's largest truck stop where we had our lunch. Then we crossed back into Illinois. And we visited the Abraham Lincoln Boyhood National Memorial in Springfield, here. Illinois. Okay, we're here. Okay. Left, walk down the street, and you'll see the house on the right. You're welcome to go inside the Widow Dean's house over here. Those are exact copies, but you, give a, you get a good feel of how it looked when they lived here. This house uh, is, a, is a lovely home. Uh, it was described as very handsome. Um, these two rooms are the formal parlors. This is his closet. Now, clothes, his clothes he hung up there. We call that uh, wardrobe, chiffre robe, armoire. We, armoire. And, and our cabin, we had a stove sort of like this. Franklin stove. It's raining in Springfield, Illinois. And I'm trying to protect my camera from it. <laughs> Fogging, so we have to wait for a little bit. Okay, you get out into this humidity, it starts to heat right up. Crossing into Kentucky here pretty soon. And finally, we are back into Tennessee. And this time we hit Nashville, Tennessee. And we're starting off with some awesome Indian food at Woodlands. That night, we visited the heart of Nashville Entertainment Strip. We're in Nashville, Tennessee right now, and before it gets too loud, we are on our way to a honky tonk, I think, to go to see some live music. Looks like a real tourist trap. The next day, we visited downtown Nashville, where you can find a full-size replica of Parthenon that was built here to commemorate the state of Tennessee centennial anniversary. Then, we went to the Nashville Farmer's Market. What is it? That's how they get the beans out of the hole, so out of the log. Put them in one of these and they shake them until they just fall out. Oh. So we are currently in the Stones River National Battlefield, and this is one of the U.S. military cemetery that we are currently driving in. A lot of people, yeah, from both sides of the war and from people who have died up to and including Vietnam. Atlanta, Georgia, 
The Midwest always holds a special place in my heart. Overall, it was a fun road trip to the Midwest. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification button so that you won't miss any exciting vlogs. And thanks for watching. why I said that. I have no idea why I just put in said that. I guess this is where he got his haircut. So we are currently in the River Stones National Battlefield. Stone River. Oh.